One of the questions I get a lot about LibreOffice is how do I make a checklist? Now I realize this should be something that's pretty simple and as it turns out it is pretty simple but it's not exactly self-explanatory and so I'm going to take a few moments today and just show you how to do it. Now here I have a grocery shopping list with several items on it and I'm going to go ahead and highlight those items and then click on the bullets button on the toolbar and then I'm going to right click on the list and go to bullets and numbering. Here you can see uh, there are several different kinds of bullets you can use and you'll also notice that there aren't any check boxes. There are squares, there's check marks, arrows and so forth but not exactly what we're looking for. So what I'm going to do is click on the options tab and then I'm going to click on the button with three dots beside character and then here we have a drop down list of all of the fonts on our system. And what exactly you have in this list is going to depend on what operating system you're using. But look for something called Wingdings or Webdings or something like that. Uh, most systems have some of those on and those fonts have lots of different uh, symbols in and usually you can find something that will suit your needs. Um, in my case I'm going to click on Webdings and we quickly can see a nice checkbox that we can use. So I'm going to click OK and OK again and you can see that we now have a checklist. Now one last thing I like to do is right click and go to line spacing and change it to one and a half lines and that just spreads the options apart a little bit and makes it a little bit easier to read. So if you like this tip be sure to press that like button and as always thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.